At the UKIP conference last month, they enjoyed Mike Reed's calypso. But the mock Caribbean accent was not a hit with others, and now the former Radio 1 DJ says he's asked the record company to withdraw it from sale. In a statement, Mike Reed said, I'm so sorry that the song unintentionally caused offence. That was never my intention, and I apologise unreservedly if anyone has taken offence. Originally, profits were being split between the Red Cross and Nigel Farage's party. Now UKIP said all the money should go to the Red Cross. The Red Cross has said, no thanks. Already this week, Nigel Farage has been accused of teaming up with an extremist Polish member of the European Parliament. So doesn't this episode make it easier to portray his party as racist? I don't think that the song is racist. I think it, 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 is, it, is, it, was, it was meant as a piece of light satire. And the uh, fact is, is that uh, really it should have been taken in that way. This afternoon, you could still buy the Calypso as a download, and the opponents of UKIP were happy to see them in some discomfort. I think they got it wrong. Uh, I'm sure it started as fun, and uh, I know Mike Reed, uh, and the fact that he has apologised, I think, is the right thing to do. But they shouldn't have done it in the first place. Uh, I mean, we know what their immigration policy is, and they're already stereotyped as not liking any sort of person who's foreign. And yet, what do they do? They produce uh, this sort of stunt, mimicking uh, Jamaicans in a calypso. But if the opinion polls are right for all those who are not singing along, there are still plenty who are. Andy Bell, 5 News.